What's going on everybody? It's 40B Nasty. I'm here to give you an update on my tank and how it's doing ever since I set up the uh, Chato reactor with the uh, C-clone that I did for a DIY project. And I gotta say that my phosphates have gone to pretty much zero. My green hair algae is dying off by the minute and it's doing great. But there's also a problem with that and that's not enough nutrients in my tank anymore. You can see my Rosses are closed up, and whatever this purple and green one you want to call is, but I still do have the green hair algae, but just most of it's uh, falling apart, so now I'm going to start having to feed my corals a lot more, and that's with um, reefroids and a little bit of coral gumbo. Um, I even lost, I don't know if I lost it yet, but one of the heads on my gold torch he hasn't come out in like four days. Tried adjusting it, but it's not working. But I'd like to give a shout out to my boys out in Ohio, Eli, Adam, and Tony. Um, they're new subscribers and uh, also great friends. Uh, Adam was actually the one who had given me the C clone to do the uh, phosphate reactor. And I'm much appreciated because. This is going to help me out so much now that I've uh, decided to do this Chato reactor. And I just got to basically balance out and figure it out what it is. I've got a new addition to the tank. I want to show you this little beauty right here. I'm going to pop a little screen on it so you can get the full effect. Oh yeah. Beautiful nice little piece. And this little guy up here. My first A can, I don't know what they call it, enchilada or something like that. <laughs> but it's cool. And one thing I also I haven't talked about yet, and that is I never told you about how I changed my toilet bowl in the back, which is basically my feeding station for my mandarin. Because that thing was ugly. So what I did was I ended up taking a hair wax container from J. Crew, and it was perfect. I ended up cutting the hole in the middle, I put the net for uh, the screen on the top, it's got a nice screw cap, it's brown so the thing is is all those baby brine shrimp when they get dumped down that tube they're gonna go looking up because they're looking for light. Well needless to say it's been working because my mandarin now comes over and takes a couple pecks at that and another good thing is the mandarin's eating frozens a couple times here and there during the day. So that I'm very happy about. But there's my Chato reactor. Thing's been running up 24-7. So the other day I did end up having my sea hair removed because the dum-dum decided to go inside the air intake for the, um, for the pump and he got stuck I mean like real stuck and that guy ended up starting shooting purple ink out and everything I was like oh no so I had to shut the filter down as quick as possible and uh, basically get that cleaned up there is a false accusation about them and they say that it's gonna poison your fish and kill them well needless to say it's not going to kill them it's just going to cloud up your tank. Get it cleaned up, that's all. One thing I'd like to say about that, because I've heard so many stories about it, but I actually did read online, that it really does nothing. It's basically just a flavor for them to uh, protect themselves. But I'm gonna give you a run through on my tank. You can see how it's doing. And my other gold torch. Looking a little thin, that's for sure. Candy cane's blown up. These all looking like they're having bad hair days. But the rocks are cleaning up, but like I said, the zoanthids are suffering a little bit from it. My blueberry gorgonia just keeps getting covered by the um, green hair algae that keeps blowing around, so I gotta keep blowing that off like 10 times a day, it seems like. But everybody's doing great. Especially that beautiful gold torch I got now. <laughs> and I got lucky too, it's starting to split ahead. So it's gonna be worth about $240 very soon, and I'm pretty excited about that. Maybe I'll sell it. Nah, I don't think so. I think it's beautiful. 
Anywho, this is 40B Nasty out. Take care.